here I am painting paintings for the musical Little Women in fall of 2019. Just like it says on the screen, I designed a set with 25 paintings. Um, so the paintings told you which scene you were in. There were walls and the paintings would switch out. So when the scene changed, the paintings would change. These are the paintings for the party. And um, they're sloppy because they were seen from 50 feet away. So I could get away with being a little bit messy. So um, that's nice when you have to paint 25 paintings. Um, I ended up having to do them in two days because I was over committed <laughs> the end of October. And um, I only ended up having two days available to paint these. Um, but it was fun, it was fast. And the girls were painting pumpkins because it was two days till Halloween and we were also working on their Halloween costumes during this. So who are you, Tim? Um, Jester from Critical Role. Yeah, Jester from Critical Role. And what did you make for your costume? Mm -hmm. I made... Mean, yeah. Horns. Horns. Yeah, and, and you made belts and buckles yeah. and yeah. pendants. And did you make her spiritual weapon? Yeah. What's her spiritual weapon? A giant lollipop. Giant lollipop. And you painted it all by yourself and it turned out great. And what were you? I was my Dungeons and Dragons character. Who's a... What's her name? Dark Star and she's a half elf. Elf rogue. Dark Star, the half elf rogue. Yeah. So what did you make for your costume? Uh, cloak, belts, buckles, pouches. Yeah, you guys were cute. I'll put up a picture. <laughs> so that was the aunt's house. This is New York. I hated, hated how this painting turned out. So I didn't actually take a picture of it. And this is also New York. This is the boarding house, but I didn't take a picture of it either for some reason, even though I didn't hate this one. Um, wasn't one of my favorites. And here they, we are at the beach in Cape Cod. Um, these were fun. I liked, I like painting landscapes because they're easier. So I saved these for the end of the day. The beach ones were um, nice and quick and um, not too complicated. And um, also the spooky trees. They're just jaggy lines and they can kind of go wherever. So when you're tired and you've been painting all day, they're a good place to end <laughs> off. And this is day two and I'm doing um, these are the paintings for their the sister's house, so these needed to be better. Um, so we've got... Uh, they finished on longer. Yeah, they were on stage for most of the show, and then the other paintings would come on stage for little parts of the show. So these I worked a little harder on, spent a little more time. So um, we've got paintings of paintings on walls, and then... Paintings of paintings, and then... Paintings of paintings of paintings of paintings. Here we've got the little dog sitting on the window seat, and Sam came in and she liked the little dog. So she painted a little dog, too, after breakfast. He's so cute. So there's Sam painting hers, and there's her painting. A little watercolor. Very cute. And then there's one more painting of the sisters. Um, more paintings of paintings. Pink and blue go together really well. That's true, they do. Yeah. So, it's important to have Pink good shading. Pink goes with there. Sam stole my phone. And then <laughs> after this painting, um, there's a painting of flowers that kind of blips here. It's really, it, that one I painted really fast. Um, but it was for the attic scene. Um, it was just in the attic, so. Oh, there's Sam working on clay with her pasta roller. And there's the flowers. Boom. And that's it. And we're done. Dun, dun, dun. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to join the guild, check out our Patreon for more fun stuff. It's so fun.